Honestly, I don't remember ever being told that I looked like him before Ron Slinker gave me the name. If I was, I don't remember it. It definitely wasn't often, but I was a big fan of his, you know, and I was imitating uh, him doing the kicks and splits from Bloodsport. And, uh, and, and I, but I thought that the name for me was something that would probably pass. I didn't know how behind it I was, but at that time I was told by Sheik and Sabu, it doesn't matter what they call you, your first couple of years, just get as much ring time as you can. I wrestled under a lot of different names on small shows. Didn't matter what, what they were doing to me. Uh, and I didn't think this would stick really, but um, afterwards, definitely uh, people started uh, telling me a lot that, uh, the, that I look like him. Some people think they're talking to him, you know, if I'm at a gas station or something. And they, if someone comes out, if someone tells me they love my movies, then I always think there's a 60, 40% uh, percent chance they're talking about me, and that's uh, against my favor. They probably mean him, but then sometimes I'll be like, that movie where you fought the shark? And I'm like, hey, he, he does mean me. Uh, but I don't notice any more um, in the later years than I do in the younger years as, as far as that goes. It's just something that I hear a lot. Um, a lot of people still, uh, I don't know if a lot, but over the years I've heard, uh, a lot of people will, will think of Shawn Michaels when they see me. I guess it's the ponytail. I don't know. But I, that's that's the number two thing that I still hear. You know, someone will be like, uh, excuse me, are you Shawn Michaels? And then um, I'll just leave it at that and be like, um, no. You know, but then if Katie says, you know, it's our, it's our RVD, like, oh, no, that's what I meant. You know, like a lot of times they have wrestler in mind and they can't think of it. Um, but then there's sometimes where they're just completely thinking that I am Shawn Michaels. But um, besides that, everything else is pretty rare. So I laugh at it. You know, I've gotten Bruce Willis like twice. <laughs> I don't know. I have to say that uh, Lionheart was probably my favorite Don Claude Van Damme film. What was yours? Well, by the way, I patterned my singlet after what Jean Claude wore in Lionheart. Uh, specifically when he was fighting in the uh, in the empty swimming pool and he had the black singlet on. That was my first wrestling outfit that I went and bought. And um, eventually, Giant Baba wanted me to wear bright colors, so I started getting them airbrushed, and he wanted me to wear boots. So, again, thank you, Giant Baba, for extending my career with the boots. Um, but I, if I have to pick one... I might just go with the with Bloodsport as as the original, um, which it wasn't his first one. He did Black Eagle, and um, there was No Retreat, No Surrender. My first couple movies were with the same production company that made No Retreat, No Surrender, so uh, so that was cool. I did Blood Moon and Super Fights with seasonal films, um, so I thought, yeah, I'm following in his path. This is cool, um, but I I loved King of the not King of, that was Billy Blank's movie. Um, Kickboxer, I love that. Uh, but uh, I guess I like the whole idea of the Kumite and the whole roundness of the whole story, the way it comes together with the blood sport. So that might be that might be my favorite, possibly. 